Monday! Monday morning! Yes! Michael Kerr, Humor at Work. Suppose there's a value in your organization, like workplace safety or customer service, that you want to make sure is ingrained into the very fabric of your culture. You want to make sure that it's front of mind, top and center, that your employees, from the senior managers to the frontline employees, are breathing and living this value day in and day out. Well, there's three areas I think you need to focus on that will help you achieve just that goal. And I call this the VCR approach. V standing for visibility, C for communication, R for recognition. Visibility, you've got to make sure it's everywhere, that people can't escape the sucker and make it fun. Have a, have a fun mascot that reminds them of the value. Create some fun badges with a fun slogan so that value is top of mind. Put it on a whiteboard when they come into the workplace in the morning. Have it on posters on the back of washroom stalls. Put it on people's paychecks stubs. It's got to be everywhere so that there is literally no escaping the presence of that value because so often it's just about making sure people are reminded, oh yeah, yeah, I got to be thinking about that all day when I'm at work today. So make sure it's visible. See communication, make sure you are talking about this all the time in serious substantive ways. Engage in real dialogues about the value. Ask challenging questions. Open up your meetings with a value moment where you take time to talk about the value, to celebrate and share success stories. Put it on your intranet site. On a weekly email that you send out, make sure you include a section that talks about stories where you show what employees are doing to make sure that value really does mean something. And not just stories from within your organization. Look for stories from outside as well. Make sure you're bringing in stories from everywhere around the world that illustrate what you mean by that value. Communication is everything and everything is communication. And the third aspect, recognition. You get more of the behaviors and attitudes you reward, you reward, easy for me to say, reward and recognize. So make sure you are celebrating milestones that champion that value and make sure you're recognizing employees who champion that value, who do something to demonstrate that value in out loud ways. Two very simple programs I think every workplace should enact to recognize their employees in, in two different ways. One is the Go the Extra Inch Award, where you celebrate those ideas and those stories of employees doing things that are just small, but they do them consistently, or they're ideas that are very small, but they're ideas that everybody can implement on a regular basis. And then at the other end of the spectrum, a Go the Extra Mile Award, a hit it out of the ballpark, home run, kind of award for those efforts that employees aren't going to be able to do every day, maybe not even every week, but those once in a while incredible opportunities or stories, those heroic, epic tales of how an employee did something well beyond the call of duty to make sure that that value really meant something. Because, as the old saying goes, actions really do speak louder than words.